today is not my day. I wake up, I get the babies ready. Well, first, rewind. Er, wake up, hubby's late. He says, get up, help me, get up, help me. We gotta get this going, we gotta get this here, get that there. So we get him ready, get him out the door. Then I gotta get the babies up. Get the babies up, get them ready, get them out the door. We get up to the truck and I'm like, oh yeah. The tire went flat yesterday. Well, it didn't go flat, but it was like let's see, 20, 25 or 26 percent. And I watched it till I got home to see if it moved a point or two points to see if I needed to get it attended to right then. It didn't move. It didn't do nothing. I kind of forgot about it until that point. We get out there. We got five pounds of pressure. I'm like, great. That's that's awesome. So I hear the air compressor still going from when my husband put air in his tire. I'm like, all right. So I'll go over there and I'll air it up real quick. We'll make it to school at least. I go over there. There's no piece on the end. I'm like, well, that's, a, that's amazing. So me, the three babies, we rode on into town. Five pounds of pressure in the tire. By the time we got to town, it was eight pounds. We go to the first place, the first place we see, apparently the last time we got tires, it was $200 cheaper than this time. The place that I went to this time is five miles apart from the other place. How in the blind hell can it be that big of a difference between places?